Hi, you guys. We're trying to head back up to Rose Park. Let's see if we can get there and not have rain. Um, it just hit. The rain hit like this, but I really want to get out. My eye this morning is feeling better. I don't know how it will feel later on today, but um, yeah, let's get going. We're going to go to Rose County Park again, and this time I'm going to show you the way. <laughs> show you the way. Peace, guys. Love you. Ooh, there's some rain. <laughs> Let's see. Kind of seeing the front of the car. I don't want you to really see the front of the car, but we'll see. Let's go. See how my eye can handle this today. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why we got the front of the truck too. Are we not set up right somehow? Something's not Turn right, right onto right. East Main Street. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, you guys, I squished you. Hold on. Let's get you open some more before I start driving. Still not heavy in the right place. Ah, oh, Kelly, come on. I know. Really? Really? We're going to take it back way. Is that good? I think that's good. Don't fall or anything. Let's go. <laughs> rain. There was no rain when I left. I was optimistic. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. We're going to get there and not be able to do anything. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I don't have a rain jacket yet. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Turn left. Turn left. Let's see. Oh. Our little navigation lady is super loud. We'll get a few more days of this. Boom. In about six miles, turn right onto Porter Creek Road okay, West. Turn it down a little bit. Porter Creek Road West. That sort of sounds like we're going to go up in the mountains. Oh, I don't know about that. It's okay. Let's go see. It's an hour and four minutes, so it can't be can't be so bad. Oh no, it's going to turn me back that way. Hmm, that's interesting. It's okay. Let's go have fun. At least we'll get there. And if all else fails and it's raining too hard, you know, you don't want to be out with a metal detector and the pouring down rain. Big metal shovel. Strike me. Well, it is just raining too, and it's not thunder and lightning. So maybe we can do it. We'll see. We will see, she says. We will see. I also gotta see how the eye's gonna tolerate it. I have a little bit of an eye owie. I'm feeling good right now. Hmm. Adventure, adventure. Take you on some back roads. Flooding season's like right upon us, so I need to get the yard done. I've been working on that. Of course, you probably won't see this until after maybe our first flood. <laughs> I'll start recording our floods for you. Well, I gotta get my stuff out of the yard before I lose everything. Mm. Gotta get the ivy off the side of the house and all that other stuff too. I got lots of work to do. So if we get a break in the rain when we're home, we're gonna go and uh, take care of some of that stuff too. Yes, it's time to get inside cleaning done. There's a lot of outside stuff I can't do right at the moment, but I'm gonna go work on it. I wonder how they're gonna do my house with this kind of rain. Were they gonna yank off the sidings? Are they gonna do one side at a time so they can complete it in a day? What are they gonna do? We're not gonna get any days without rain for months, according to my, my neighbors. I don't even think rain was in the forecast, that's the funny part. But here, it rains. I do want to get some really good rain gear. I did bring my huge jacket today too, so we'll see how that goes. Some of you are going, but Kelly, you're not going to take us on a nice, beautiful drive today. Nope. We have gone into rain. Just wait until we hit snow. I don't know what I'll be doing when it's snowing. I don't know that I'll be leaving. Um, because there's no one to help me if I get stuck. Well, AAA is always there, I guess. But yeah, they would like to have the thing. Hmm. Train sitting on on the side, getting ready to load up for stuff. Looks like it's full of like wood. Moose feels a little bit depressed. I gotta start taking him in the car. It's getting cold enough where he can go in the car again. Hmm. 
are you really there? No, that has to be a guy. That's not what I said. No, that's just a guy. I was gonna say, holy moly, are you a speed trap? It's not. This is a motorcycle rider. Local produce ahead. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I have some cash. No, we'll see when we come back. keep going potty on the back porch. I'm really mad. <laughs> it's like, get out into the yard. Run down. Go be quick. Come back up. I have a cut out there. I mean, if the ground is wet, but it's not. They get the shade. They get the canopy of the big apple tree. I haven't even looked at the apple tree to see if there's any apples to eat. In two miles, turn right onto Porter Creek Road West. All these back roads you guys get to go on. This is Malone. The city of Malone. Maloney, baloney. Oh, no, just kidding. See if we get all the way out to Rose, if it's Rose County Park, if it's uh, raining. Uh, when I left, it, there was no rain. Let's go. Mm -mm. Gotta get out of the house, Grandma. Grandma needs to get a butt home and do some work. Um, I need to buy some serious rain gear. Rain, rain um, overalls or something that I can go and work out in the yard in. Start embracing. Hey, here comes a train. There you go. I gotta start embracing the farm life. Just know that there'll be days I'm outside, and no matter what the weather's like, I'll go get uh, in the next couple of days. I gotta go get some salt too. There we go. There's our train, guys. Lots of trains here. Use lots the right lane to turn onto Porter Creek Road West. Oops, I'm not be stuck. Hmm. Let's see how long the train is. Is this it? Yeah, this is Porter Creek Road. Yep. I Turn am right. Back for a bit. Oh, that's weird. Okay. We are stopped. There you guys go. You can look at the train for a while. Hmm. This is going to be interesting. It's not complete yet. It's not ready to go yet. Boom, Porter Creek Road West. Okay, that's not right. Is In three right? quarters yeah, of a mile, right. turn left onto South Bank okay, Road. Let's see. Ooh, a speedboat in the river. The river's getting high. Boat with a motor going by fast. He's feeling confident. Hmm. 
I wouldn't go fast in the rivers at all because you never know where you're going to hit a sand spot or a snag or something sitting in the river. But he, that guy had confidence. He was just buzzing. South Bank Road. We're going to turn left on South Bank Road. I brought the eye drops with me. It's funny, the, the doctor, the pharmacist said, I don't know what he wrote. Turn <laughs> left onto wrote, South Bank no Road. <laughs> it's okay. I said, I know what to do. When it irritates, I do 10 o'clock every day, a.m., p.m., 4 o'clock every day, a.m., p.m., and if it gets way, way too irritating sometime in between. <laughs> In about eight and a half miles, turn right onto Garrard Creek Road. Uh, so we're going to go adventuring. We're seriously taking the back way. It's going to be super cool. Super cool. Let's see what we can find, guys. so many places where there's farms and stuff. Oh, there's an old cemetery. Ooh, gotta go look at the old cemeteries. That'll be, an, that'll be another thing we do at some point. Sharon. That must be in the city of Sharon. Cemetery is Sharon. I don't know. Maybe it's a private one. fun to take videos in the cemetery of some names and then try and see if we can figure out the history of the people. That would be a super cool thing to do. But, you know, I bet a lot of them aren't in a history book or anything like that. Family might be. Still would be fun. It's a feedlot. Sky looks pretty outside of it, so it's pretty for you. It's good for me. I have music playing in my head today. It's always an interesting thought. I love being out, guys. Now, see, we might be able to metal detect just fine. See, the rain went away. It's been doing that for like all week. The rain comes really hard, really fast, then it goes away, then it comes back, then it goes away. Oh, beware of tractors. <gasps> no, we're not on one of those roads. Yes, you are. I love these roads. Beware of tractor roads. Cow sleeping out in the yard. I'm not going to get any more pets, you guys. I'm done with pets. Yeah. I keep thinking I'll get chickens. I keep thinking I'll get a goat. I don't know. What am I going to do with the chicken? I can't, can't kill it and eat it. God knows I can't do that. I can't do that. <laughs> Why not, Grandma? I just can't, you guys. Oh, that water's very stagnant. Ugh, it's yucky water. Won't be stagnant here in a few months. I mean, in a few weeks. By the time you guys see that, that water over there won't be stagnant, that's for sure. <laughs> no, but it is right now. It's building up. It's getting ready to flood. And then it'll move onto all the fields. Always wonder when there's something like that just sitting out in a field. <laughs> yeah. Okay. 
this park we're going to has a very nice bathroom. It is super old. The park bathroom is old and everything, but it's super old. So you guys look up Rose County Park and check it out. I can't even find it on the map. Um, I have an address for where it's at, but if you look up parks or you put in the name, it doesn't come up at all. And it feels to me, because it has the old killer metal slides, remember? That used to get super hot and you slide down them and your legs would stick and you burn the back of your legs and you, you go home from playing all day around the neighborhood and over at the park and down to the rec center and you, whatever it was in your area and you come home and you have these big burns on the back of your leg and, and you go, dang it, I should have wore pants again, but it was super hot so you didn't want to, right? And your mom would say, man, you been on the slides again? And it's like, yep red hot burning burning and it wasn't from the sun it was from burning yourself on the playground equipment because it wasn't made of plastic it was all made of metal and the metal got hot like super hot hmm. but yeah i want to go check out the upper part of the park today we'll see we'll see where people are also brought my big shovel and it's kind of like it's been raining pretty good so i should, might be able to dig some big plugs Thing with the big plugs is you can kill you can kill you can wipe out many big targets at one time you know how the garbage is all close together you just pull a big plug and flip it sit down with your pinpointer and get all the stuff out of it and then put it back i do have my towel i think still in here somewhere a lot of old farmhouses out here would be really fun i have um hood billy make me some uh, metal cards so i can hand them out to ask people to do their yards. I'd really like to do some of the little houses in the old towns because you know those there was stuff there forever and there's been stuff there. There's gonna be a lot of garbage though, but that's okay too. Let's see, to this Saturday is the twenty fourth. I have a class all day Saturday. I didn't get to go to oh you guys won't see this till way after I didn't get to go to the gun club meeting last night I got out in the air and my eye just was like ow crazy ow so I went to the emergency room again but they put the numbing stuff in it and I feel so much better those guys are really nice look at that old barn thing oh my gosh just to go do around that once I got all the garbage out <laughs> I don't mind the garbage. I like the old garbage too, which is kind of crazy. I have my sunglasses and I have my shooting glasses. I can't drive in my reading glasses, but I could put either one of those on it. It would protect the air from my eyes if I have to turn up the air conditioning too far. But it's good to get out. It's bad to stay home. I can't stand sitting, sitting, sitting. And once I get uh, the house all organized, it's going to be super easy to keep clean. So today we're going to spend some time doing that kind of stuff too. It's Wednesday today. I'm going to go hit the Zoom meeting and see the guys. way past that or stuff so I'm good with what's on it if I have to put another house a roof on it for some reason it might not but I don't you know, see that happening I gotta wash off my back deck my back porch. I can't stand that the dogs keep going potty on that. It's starting to make me super unhappy. Hmm. 
I put them outside past that. I have it all barricaded off so they can't get on the porch. Leave them outside for a half an hour or longer. They're just standing into the rain part. And then they wait. And then they come in and they play around for a little bit. I leave the back door open and I sneak out like a pool on the deck on the porch. Oh, that's something. Oh, yeah, that's a place we can go. Look at that. It has an outhouse and everything. Oh, that's cool. It's wildlife and fishery. I don't know what it is. We'll have to remember it's here. South Bank Road has a place we could go and check out too. If we come back this way, I'll dip in there and take a look at it. I have a car coming up behind me. I am doing the speed limit. But they have lots of room they can pass me on, so it's okay. See, even more of these newer houses. In one mile, turn are, right maybe, onto Gerard Creek Road. Maybe the houses were built in the 70s or something. The land that it's on is old, and there was something older there before. For the, where the um, trailers and stuff are. Yeah. It has some old places in it, too. That's cool. Old outbuildings. in the yard. It, they take it places. It's just funny to me. I love the ones that aren't even up on the trailer. They're just sitting down on the ground. Say, dude, you fled to there? <laughs> oh, here, we're going to turn this way. Turn right onto Gerard Creek Road. Okay, here's Gerard Creek Road. Well, actually, it's called, oh, it decides to Brooklyn. Yeah, we got to get back to Brooklyn and do the school one day when the school is not in session yet. So we can't do it. So my kicks it out. Okay, we're going 35. Brooklyn's in, in about miles. three and a half miles. Take a slight left turn onto Gerard Creek Road. Exploring. Motorcycle repair. roads are so jacked. They're all different angles and up and down and angling this way and angling that way. If it was snowy, you don't want to be on these roads. <laughs> if you didn't slide off one side, you'd slide off the other. And the other side though, looks like a bank. It has a ditch that's so deep that even my truck would be sideways if we went into it. And the other side, just down the hill, baby, just down the hill. Nothing to stop you either. <laughs> We will not be going on too many adventures when the road has snow on it, guys. I'm so sorry. I'm trying to get ahead of the game just for that for you. <laughs> oh, I want to take a day and do the whole um, 101 loop all the way around the peninsula. And seriously, just run 101. Places yet? We got some rain going on our windshield. There's some electrical wire down. That has to be bad. I wonder who's not extraordinarily excited about that. Pretty, 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 pretty. It's 35 here. That's how jacked the road is. They don't want you going faster than that. Oh, ho, ho. It's a big leave the rusty equipment in the middle of the field like it's um, 
like it's a statue or something. <laughs> it's okay, I think it's cool. Old farm equipment just left in the middle of the field, rusting away. W.J. Lemon. That's how that dairy was. I know I've seen that lemon, that name like that. I've seen it in the um, books that I've been reading. It's somewhere. I'm going to find it again and remember it. Because this would be that then the area that they settled. It's an old painting on the barn. These barns are old. That'd be really cool. I know I've seen that name before. In one mile, take a slight left turn onto Garrard Creek Road. I don't think we can go on Garrard Creek Road. I think that I'm remembering something about something closed and the kind of detour spit. Gotta find out though. Here we go. And it keeps going with the road, but it tells me to turn somewhere where I can't or something or like that. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Maybe I'm, I'm thinking of another road. Gosh knows, I've been everywhere through back here, everywhere. And I get really confused about where I've been and where I haven't been. <laughs> right. I'm going to find Moose's vest and start bringing him with me again. Um, uh, it just got too hot. I might put up the uh, shield in the car so he stays in the back. So it gets out the day when it needs to. Yeah, I think this is the funky part. Let me see what happens. Let's see how she gets upset about something, or maybe she doesn't. Yeah, this is it. it used to go over. Proceed to, to the, the left. Route. Okay, but that road's fenced off and closed, which means they probably had a very hard time keeping it up and running. Um, and then we slow down to 25. Up and running while the um, take a slight left turn. Flooding happens because now they put this in road seven here. and a half miles. Turn right onto Manners Road. <sighs> oh, now we're 25. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. I don't know why it's 25. Maybe this has to be a little town of some sort. Maybe it's a town of Gerard. Might have missed something. I mean, I don't think there's a store or anything here. I think it's just a little collection of houses. This one right in front of us with the green roof looks exciting to do. It looks like one of the original Sasquatch is up on the hill. You guys see him? There's Sasquatch up on the hill. I wonder if he saw him. You'll have to go back and look again if you missed him. And this is probably why this takes so long to get where we're going. Is this part of the road is 25. I'm going to guess it's because they have problems in certain seasons with it. And then it's really super twisty. But, you know, I could just be thinking. Just be thinking. It's a skinny road too, it's super skinny. Again, nothing to keep you on the road on the side here. <laughs> but then you just go down into a pasture, but steeply down into the pasture. And then again, the ditch on the other side, the bank side, is really deep. So we'll tip you over to the ditch. 
can still be tipped over. Uh, wait, can on. Mm -hmm. I wonder how long it's going to be 25. Cruise control, baby. Cruise control, baby. Forgotten places. Entering Lewis County. We're getting to a new county, folks. The road suddenly changes. <laughs> oh my gosh, what do you think? 